girls. Now I get tons and tons of messages every day asking about fat loss. So I thought it would be good for me to jump on here and give you some of my top fat loss tips. My first tip is, and probably the most important is, in order to lose fat, you have to be in a calorie deficit. Now everyone's got a base rate of calories that they have to be eating to in order to either lose weight or put on weight. If you are overeating above that and going over your calories, you will put on weight. If you're in a calorie deficit, you will start losing weight and start seeing results. Tip number two is consume more water. Half of us are walking around quite dehydrated and sometimes we think we're hungry when we're not. We just need some water. You need to aim for drinking two to three litres a day. And also a little tip for you is try and get that wee flushed to quite a clear colour or just a light yellow by midday. Because that shows then you're drinking enough water and getting it through your body. Tip number three is consume high protein foods. Protein keeps us fuller for longer and repairs our muscles. If you've got a plate of food, ideally you wanna be looking for half of it to be full of veggies or salad, a quarter of it to be full of carbs, and a quarter to be full of protein. Tip number four is set a daily step target. If you are not getting up and moving much, then that's really gonna affect your fat loss. So first of all, if you only walk 2,000 a day, start setting your target to be 5,000 a day and start increasing it as you gradually get a little bit more fitter and a lot more active. Tip number five, and probably the most important, is get enough sleep, guys. You need to be aiming for seven to eight hours a night. If you have a rubbish night's sleep, you don't really feel energized at all. You feel lethargic and you just want to go back to bed. So aim to get to bed early, put that phone down, knock the TV off, and get a good night's sleep. It's so important. Tip number six is prep your meals. If you can do things the night before or the day before, then do it because that will give you less chance of falling off the wagon and not meeting your goals. Number eight, try and use dry seasoning rather than sauces for your food. Within about a 30 ml sachet of sauce, there's an extra 120 calories, which we don't really need. So try and aim to get those dry seasoning for your food rather than sauces. Number nine, get rid of the lattes. They've got tons of calories in. Aim for drinking black coffee. It's a stimulant as well, so also gonna give you a little bit more energy and it's great for fat loss more energy, work out harder, burn more cows. And my final tip is reduce the alcohol. Now there's two reasons for this. First and foremost is that there's tons of empty calories and it's so, so easy to take it over your target whilst drinking alcohol. And the second reason is the following day, if you've if you've drunk too much alcohol the night before, the following day, you're not ready for exercise, you're not feeling motivated and you don't wanna eat healthy. Therefore, that's two days coming off plan. So if, if you can, if possible, try and choose lower calorie drinks and obviously drink in moderation. So guys, if you need help getting on plan and you're looking for fat loss today, then head to www.carouslouisefitness.com and I'm happy to help you out and welcome you on board to the Girl Guide.